Biotechus dates back to 2017, when we were growing hemp and thought about vertically integrated business, from growing hemp to end products. And then in 2020, uh, when the COVID hit us, we decided to jump into the real business of biotech by signing a EU granted project. We see biotechnology and healthcare in general as very interesting markets. Over the years, Tessonet built up experience working with mindfulness, healthcare, longevity, tech companies, so we can offer an increasingly growing scope of know-how. Most importantly, it's a market that creates a truly meaningful impact in our lives. I am Jonas, I am the co-founder of Biotechos, a biotechnology startup, which is based in Lithuania. I started my journey with the cannabinoids back in 2017, uh, when I was doing a lot of uh, sports of triathlon, seven days a week, holding also family of four, and not having enough sleep. So I decided to biohack my daily lifestyle, and that's how I found cannabis. Hi, I'm Darius. Uh, I was always interested in how cannabinoids interact with the human body. And in that way, Biotechus was born to create products which would benefit the people uh, working in very stressful routine to live a normal life. Uh, so, from growing hemp to R&D labs and to GMP facility, we mainly focus on creating the products which benefit the people. Biotech was formed a great recipe for success by having these crucial elements. A team full of passionate and inspiring personalities, focused on a growing market full of potential and product quality. Members of Testnet Accelerator and Biotechos meet regularly to bounce off ideas and be devil's advocates. We discuss strategic questions with founders and our marketing, legal and finance teams are also always in touch. Well, we are always sure that we have support from knowledgeable people, pro Tessonet uh, employees, which uh, helps us and navigates us how we can find the solution to a problem we are facing with. And in that way, we can start thinking more widely with other options we can bring up on. So our key challenges are unlocking specific markets, coping with the changing regulations, and unlocking the most potential market, US. And also, one of the biggest challenges of Biotechos is to educate the end customers that CBD is not narcotics. My advice would be respect what is given, stay disciplined, and stay hungry.